Modern diesel engines are fitted with a diesel particulate filter, DPF for short. Diesel particulate filters filter the soot particles released during the combustion process in a diesel engine. The soot is a sign of incomplete combustion, and the diesel particulate filter ensures that emissions of these harmful diesel exhaust gases are kept to a minimum. In practice, these new technologies often result in new problems, warnings and faults, which each diesel car will have to contend with sooner or later. How it works A diesel particulate filter is fitted as closely as possible to the engine in the exhaust system. When the exhaust gases flow through the diesel particulate filter, the soot particles are trapped, while the other elements of the exhaust gas are emitted through the porous walls of the filter. The soot particles collect in the filter, and the collected particles must be burnt to keep the filter clean. This combustion process is also known as regeneration. A temperature of approximately 600 degrees C is required to ensure effective combustion which is often only achieved under extremely high engine load. During short journeys or city centre driving, the temperature does not reach any higher than 400 degrees C. As a result, the filter remains full and the electronics try to regenerate. This increases fuel consumption and moreover, the functioning of the diesel particulate filter suffers. It can be the case that the blocked filter reduces engine power or causes damage to the engine. What is the solution? Step 1. By adding a special diesel additive, the ignition temperature of the soot is lowered. This is a preventative solution to prevent troublesome problems and faults. And we recommend using JLM Regen Plus. Simply safely add 100 milliliters of this additive per 50 liters of diesel to your fuel tank, which will prevent any potential problems. Step 2. When the diesel particulate filter warning light on your dashboard is illuminated, use the JLM DPF cleaner. This cleaner is perfect for all modern diesel engines and is formulated with a high concentration of the active working ingredient. The JLM DPF cleaner complies with the most stringent VERT requirements, the Swiss Environmental Standard and those of the US Environmental Protection Agency so you can be sure that you will be able to solve the problem by non-toxic but extremely effective means. Step 3. When the diesel particulate filter is decontaminated to such an extent that even the JLM DPF cleaner cannot solve the problem, then JLM provides a yet more intensive solution, namely the JLM cleaning kit. This solution is more economical than replacing the diesel particulate filter and saves not only money but also time. Your garage will be able to solve this problem in one hour at most. Take your car to a specialist and they will spray a highly concentrated cleaner into the diesel particulate filter a few times and allow the engine to run at two to 3,000 revolutions per minute. Afterwards, one and a half liters of flushing liquid is flushed through the filter while the motor runs at two to two and a half thousand revolutions per minute, resulting in foam coming out of the exhaust. The regeneration process may now commence. This can be done by using a program on the onboard computer or by a drive on the motorway. To guarantee smooth running of your car, we recommend you regularly add JLM Regen Plus to your diesel. And in the event of persistent problems, add JLM DPF Cleaner as often as necessary. Would you like to find out more about JLM diesel products or where to buy them? Then visit our website for more information about the number one in lubricant products, www.jlmlubricants.com.